As Singapore says a global system to ensure proper carbon trading and accounting will be desperately needed over the next three years to tackle the climate crisis. As countries push for a green recovery, there's hope a plan will be firmed up at the United Nations Climate Change Conference, COP26. The call from Singapore's Sustainability and the Environment Minister Grace Fu have been made at the CNA Leadership Summit. Vanessa Lim reports. A strong push for climate action as 150 business leaders, scientists and government officials came together at the CNA Leadership Summit to discuss green recovery. The broadcaster has committed to putting the spotlight on climate change. As national media network, we are uniquely positioned to use our creative capabilities, our journalistic expertise and the wide reach of audiences to raise awareness on climate change, support Singapore's Green Plan 2030 and drive the adoption of sustainable practices. This could help to put sustainability back on the agenda, with major climate talks delayed last year due to COVID-19. It stalled progress in getting countries to come together and forge a carbon trading rulebook to ensure proper accounting and reporting. That's after the Paris Agreement paved the way for countries to create a global carbon market to cut emissions. That's what we are hoping to achieve come this COP26. And we hope that we have laid down a set of good set of rules that all parties around the table feel confident that when we do our next big push on financing, we are doing the right decision in financing projects that are of high quality that can meet acceptable sustainability standards. One expert says the ongoing pandemic could actually spur a new wave of international collaboration. We've seen the successes of that during the pandemic in terms of exchanges of science and exchanges in data. So I think that's the mechanism as we move forward. We need to have transparency between governments so we can properly account for the amount of carbon dioxide that's being released. Singapore will bring to the table its expertise in climate research at the COP26 in Glasgow in November. Prime Minister Lee Hsien Loong is expected to share more about investments in green solutions and climate science and the importance of global collaboration.